Hey, welcome to this video. And uh, if you arrived here, you're probably looking for more information on the Fiverr affiliate program. Uh, so I'll go over how it works and I'll give you my two cents whether I think you should promote it or not. Uh, so Fiverr, in case you don't know, it's a platform that offers different services uh, from freelancers. So everything from animation to um, programming to graphic art to audio to online marketing like search engine, engine optimization, writing, translating, even cooking lessons. Uh, but the main focus, uh, a lot of internet marketers use their services. So, And um, so as a way of generating income, I don't really recommend uh, Fiverr, but for entrepreneurs who, who need like to outsource work, uh, it's like minor tasks like design, not that those are minor, but you know what I mean? Uh, then yeah, it's, it's definitely a great uh, uh, website. Um, like if I wanted to design my uh, YouTube banner, I would probably go to Fiverr for that. But as far as their affiliate program, uh, I'll get more into that right now. Um, so there's actually five different uh, services you can promote. Um, so it's their, their affiliate program is divided into five. So there's the Fiverr, uh, just the Fiverr standard. Uh, it's, it's the page you see when you uh, first go to the Fiverr's website. And it's just basic services like uh, what freelancers would provide, just very basic services um, that I just talked about. Fiverr Pro, uh, it's an upgrade to the standard service. Um, so people basically charge higher prices and it, it's higher end work. So this is what Fiverr Pro looks like. See, they're charging, as opposed to charging maybe five, five or 10 bucks, they're charging, you know, in the hundreds. So, and then, uh, and then the third, uh, uh, service is learn from Fiverr. That's different courses you can promote, uh, mostly in online marketing, some, you know, web design, uh, technology, stuff of that nature. It's a lot of digital marketing. marketing. Um, and then, uh, and then, uh, and then there's, and the fourth one is called and, and co, um, and that's for helping freelancers and small businesses with managing their workloads and sending out their invoices. Um, and the last, the last service you can promote is um, uh, Fiverr Business, and that's for that's just for larger teams, right? Providing talent for larger teams. So, but if you're here, you're maybe just a solopreneur. I would maybe go with the Learn from Fiverr um, or the Fiverr Pro because it pays the most. Um, Learn from Fiverr is good because it's digital and I like, I think promoting digital products is the best way to go. A digital product is just something you can click on and get immediate access to. Um, and then, but, but then Fiverr Pro is great because it has the highest payouts. I'll get into that in a bit. Um, now there is an application process for the Fiverr affiliate program. Um, first of all, you must already have a Fiverr account. It's pretty easy to sign up for one. It takes a few minutes to sign up. Uh, then let them know where you'll be sending traffic from. So whether you have your own blog, a social media presence, maybe you have a YouTube channel. Because um, they, they don't want you just spamming your link, affiliate links everywhere, right? They want to protect their brand. So, so you already need some kind of online presence. Um, then, you, then you're going to submit payment details. How would you like to get paid? Um, your billing address and the two payment methods uh, you can do it to your bank account or PayPal which is really nice and easy that they do that so because um, a lot of a lot of affiliate programs uh, don't do it through PayPal um, yeah they're they're, they're they have, their affiliate program has great support um, it's very easy to navigate the dashboard they provide you with different marketing tools and creative assets to promote their stuff that can be a double-edged sword I mean it's good that they're providing you help uh, but you never want to rely 100 percent on other people's stuff you always want to kind of tweak things uh, make it your create your own wrapper around your promotions kind of brand yourself a bit um, otherwise you just start looking like everyone else and then your conversions drop uh, so it's always important to look unique um, no matter what you're promoting online um, that's just a little pro tip um, yeah, and you can join their affiliate program for free and and you can really promote it however you want as long as you're not using, doing anything sketchy like sending paid advertising directly 
directly to the affiliate page, which I wouldn't recommend doing anyway, because <laughs> that's the fastest way to go broke. Um, and uh, yeah, the, the and also you get paid by referring new buyers only, not new sellers, if that makes sense. So so people looking to purchase uh, services from from Fiverr or Fiverr freelancers, but not the freelancers themselves. So yeah, only get commissions for buyers, not sellers, and they have to be new. They can't be someone who's already on buying on the platform. Um, and their commission structure, um, to be honest, is quite complicated. If you go to the uh, FAQ section, frequently asked questions section, and then I'll, and then you can find this page through there. It's quite complicated. I'm not going to go through all of it because it would take way more than the length of this video. Um, yeah, but just just go read all of it. Um, um, there's basically uh, three different uh, commission plans, um, all for first time buyers only, and and the payouts vary between fifteen dollars and one hundred and fifty dollars is the highest you can get, and that's for the Fiverr Pro plan is the one hundred and fifty um, Pro services. Which, I mean, makes sense because look at look at how much uh, Fiverr look how much Fiverr Pro costs. So now, should you promote it? That's a whole other issue because it might be kind of hard to convince someone to purchase these services, right? So that's something you have to kind of think about. Um, and it all depends, and the payout depends, all depends on, you know, the niche, the different plan of the five plans, and just the product or service you're promoting. So it really varies. I can't really give you an exact. It's going to be between 15 and 150. Um, so yeah, read this page. This is really important. Go through all that. And then the cookie is 30 days, which is pretty standard in affiliate marketing. 30-day um, cookie. And uh, so the question you need to be asking yourself is now is should you promote uh, the Fiverr affiliate program? Uh, to be honest, as great as Fiverr is, um, no, I would not. I would not promote their stuff probably. Um, um, just because I mean the most you're the most you're going to get is one hundred fifty dollars, which you know, which is okay, but. Um, to, to be honest, it's not going to be easy. Like I said before, it's not going to be easy to convince people to to buy these services in the first place. I don't think. Um, I usually like to stick to digital products. So again, some type of online video training or you know ebooks um, or you know some or podcasts, something someone can click on and get immediate access to. Um, so yeah. Um, but if you just go promote their digital products, like these would be considered digital products, but but the price points are so low, you're really not going to be making much money from these. So, yeah. Um, yeah, so yeah. Sorry, I just want to make sure I'm covering everything. Um, but yeah, if you already have a large audience, maybe, and you're in the internet marketing niche, um, yeah, you might be able to make some money from the Fiverr affiliate program, um, but probably not as much as you could be making by promoting um, higher ticket digital products. That's my opinion. Um, and and there's plenty of those online. I won't get into that. Um, now look, maybe you're here, you're not necessarily sold on uh, the Fiverr affiliate program. You just want a way to do affiliate marketing and learn how to promote the right products. Um, what I suggest doing is clicking the link below. Uh, you get access to a four-day training series, and you're going to learn all about you know everything. It's going to give you the entire blueprint for affiliate marketing. You know how to pick good products to promote, um, what criteria to look for when you're picking a product to promote, like the payment structure. Um, you know, it'll talk about something called a value ladder, where, where, um, what that is, it's basically, um, so you want to pick something that has um, a low entrance fee and that has has different upsells. So maybe it costs someone thirty seven dollars to get in, and then the the first upsell would be you know one hundred ninety seven dollars. The second upsell could be, you know, a thousand dollars, and 
and, just, and that's just going to increase your customer lifetime value. So um, it'll talk about the best affiliate networks, where to actually find great products, and in any niche you're in, any niche you want to go into. So whether you're in the internet marketing niche, or or maybe you decide you want to go into weight loss, or or you know personal development, uh, doesn't really matter. You can you can there's always going to be products to promote. So uh, the training will also teach you how to build trust with people without necessarily being an influencer or having a huge audience. Because uh, trust is kind of the cornerstone of selling online. Um, just because it's online, that it's kind of, it's the same as real life, really. That's like how do people from real life buy? It's from people they like, know, and trust, right? It's the same thing with online. And then how to actually promote your stuff um, um, by attracting people who are already looking for what you want to sell. Um, and and it has nothing to do with. Uh, blogging or paid advertising. I don't recommend either of those for beginners. Um, so you're going to learn how to generate an endless flow of quality leads into your business um, every day so your well never goes dry. Um, so yeah, lots of good stuff in there. Um, but yeah, again, it's your life, your business. If you want to promote Fiverr stuff, you can. Um, you know, I would, uh, I would maybe suggest sticking with the pro plan just because um, again, it's the highest payouts. Um, it doesn't really make sense to promote so something where you're only making $15, right? You'll never be able to make your income goals that way. Um, so yeah, but I still think, I still suggest clicking the link below, checking that out. Um, anyway, I hope you got some value out of this video. I hope to see you on the other side, obviously, and I hope you have a great day. Bye.